Today we're going to skin a new shirt rat. This is one that we caught on the line, so I'm going to show you the cuts. We'll walk you through it. First thing you want to do with your neutral rat, you want to roll him over. You see his legs here. You got to cut him off. You got to ring him off and cut them off. And uh, same same thing you kind of do with a beaver or any other pelted raccoons, things like that. We'll go pop his feet off like that right there. Sit those over there to the side. Just going to ring them right on around here. All right? Going to roll right on off. Second thing I like to do is, is you got to lip them. Nutria, their gums roll inside of their mouth, as you see there. So what you want to do here is, is you want to come in here on the lower jaw, and you just want to slightly cut next to his head. It's hard for you fellows to see this, or other folks at home, but I'm just lipping him, basically. Just making this easier for me when I get ready to do this. I'm just taking his bottom lip, as you see there now. You can see right down in there. How I just lift him away. This helps so when you get ready to go and tube him, it'll help you later. So that's basically all you're doing is that right there. Just like that. All right. Second or third cut. Basically from his heel to the top of his tail. From his heel to the top of his tail. So what we're going to do here is. All right. From his heel up to the top of his tail. So we're going to stick this knife in here. We're going to run this right up here to the top of the base of his tail. Just like so, right? Now I'm going I'm to do the opposite side. I'm going to run him just like this. I'm going to run him right up to the top of his tail. Right? Then we're going to take it and we're going to cut down on his tail. Just like that. So you should have a cut that looks just like that right there. That's how this cut should look. Okay? What I'm going to do here is I'm going to start this just a little bit with my knife. I'm going to start right here like this. Just a little bit. Down his leg side. All right? Down his other leg side. Just a little bit. We're going to open him up a little bit. Down his other leg side there just a little bit more. And you're gonna reach your hand and you're gonna peel him. Reach your hand up in here, get him peeled up his back a little bit. At this point, you're gonna sit him on his back. You're gonna grab the front of his face. And where you made that cut, you're gonna push him inside out. Just like that. Just like that, right there. So I just pushed him inside out. Now you got an inside out nutrient right. Right? Now you're gonna come over here. You can grab that stomach liner, work this hide down a little bit, just like that. Roll him over over here on this other side. You want to work his fur off his belly line. Just like that, right? And what you can do is come up over here on his other leg. We're up over here and over here. All right. Come back behind his leg just a little bit here. I'm just gonna free that up behind his other leg. I'll get my hands through here on this other side. Take this knife, and you're gonna cut him off at the base of his tail on the other side. Just like that, right? And you cut his fur off his one bottom leg, come up over here off the other bottom leg, just like that right there. Okay. At this point here, you're gonna grab him, you're gonna step on his tail. Pull him up. When you pull him up, you're going to grab them front legs, you're going to pull them out. Just like that. And you're going to grab a hold of him. Right? And these two arm holes. Stick your finger in that one hole, the front leg hole. And get my thumb in the other one. Can't really get my thumb in the other one. Let's see if we can swirl around. Like that right there. Grab his neck, pull him down past his lips. You already did the ringing. Just like that. Now what you do is, you come over here, back behind his head a little bit, pull it down to his ears. Cut his ear right there, cut his ear right there, pull him down to his eyes. Come over here, cut his one eye out, cut his other eye out, just like that right there. Pull him on down to his nose. Cut his nose, ring around his nose. 
And that's how you skin a nutrient rat. And you turn them on the inside out. You can, at this point, you can flesh them or you can go ahead and freeze them until you get a bunch of them and press them together. There he is. It's a quick way to skin a nutrient rat. It's Kevin and James with Lazy Pond Farm Fish and Hunt. If you like our content, please subscribe. Check out some of our other videos.